Hello guys and welcome to this video with me, it's Honey Nerdfire and today I'm going to be talking about the classes that I use on Call of Duty Ghosts. So we're going to go straight into it and the first class here as you can see is the MSBS with um, red dot sight and um, foregrip. I use this gun quite a lot um, because it's a pretty good gun, <laughs> pretty OP to be honest. The damage, this probably can get a kill in two bursts and I've just got a 44 Magnum to a wheel just as a secondary, I don't really use that. I'll probably switch that back to probably my PDW. And then the perks I use, well you can see there, a stalker, quick draw, focus and hardline. They're all good useful perks for the MSBS in my opinion because if you use stalker you can move faster while you're aiming. Then you've got quick draw, faster aiming, then focus which means you've basically got less recoil when you're shooting and hardline to get your streaks. So the, sh the package, like the street strike package I'm using is assault with SATCOM, Guard Dog and Battlehind. I like this because if you get the SATCOM, sometimes it's a bit dodgy the SATCOM, but it will um, show you where people are, then you get kills towards your dog, then your dog gets your kills before towards your Battlehind, which is pretty cool. So the next class is the AK-12 with foregrip and red dot sight. I quite like this gun, it's pretty good to like, I'll switch between that, the MSBS, and probably a sniper mainly. And then I've got Bison as secondary, I've got because I've got overkill. It's a good secondary gun just to pull out in case you're in trouble. Then the perks here are ready up, stalker, on the go, focus and overkill. All useful um, perks sorry, for this class. And I've also got the assault package with the same streaks. I think I use the same streaks in most of my classes. Then we go on to the Remington. I don't use this much at all. It's just like it's a pretty it's a good gun, but I just don't really use it. It's sort of the same as my MSBS class, but with extra attachment instead of um faster aiming, which was I can't remember what it was, it might have been quick draw or something like that. Because I wanted to add on the extended mags because you'll run out of ammo quite a bit on um this gun. And the same strike package assault. I think I use that on every single class to be honest. Then we've got the SC2010 with foregrip and silencer. I use this when I'm trying to go around the map and get some kill streaks. And then obviously the Bison um, on overkill. And then we've got Scavenger on this um, class because I run out of ammo quite a bit. So I decided to put Scavenger on this one instead of thing. But I'm actually going to change that to Stalker. So I can move faster while aiming. And like usual, Assault. But I didn't, I didn't want Maniac on actually. There we go. So there we go, that's that class. And then another AK-12 class with silencer for running around map like like the previous class, the SC-2010. And about the same perks, apart from I've got Stalker, Ready Up, Extra Attachment and Focus. They're the ones I use, use for that because I want all these attachments on it. So that will make it more damageable. Uh, that will keep the, uh, the what's it called? Recall, yeah, reduce recall, it says it there. Uh, so you own like go like spray everywhere and silence it to keep off the map from the enemies and I'm gonna change this one as well to the PDW. So that's that class, done. Same strike package as well, assault. And then the last class is my sniper class, it's chrome lined Um Chrome lined uh, attachments with armor piercing. And then no secondary, no lethal, no tactical, and these perks, ready up, sleight of hand, stalker, quick draw and focus. I've got these so I can aim quicker and like less recoil and flinch when I shoot. And the same streaks, but I need to get rid of Maniac because I never use Maniac. So that's about it guys. Thanks for watching this video. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you on my next video. Goodbye.